What's up you guys, it's Matt here. So people are asking me all the time about how much they can end up making if they have a low amount of Shiba. People are saying that they have 2 million Shiba or 10 million Shiba or 20 million Shiba and they don't have as much as some of these other people that have billions of Shiba Inu coin that are out there. And I wanna let you guys know that you can make money from Shiba Inu with the 10 year plan, five year plan, all of that. If you're looking for hundreds of thousands or millions of dollars or life changing amounts of money, I think that you can make money with Shiba. Now understand, everything I say here is not financial advice, it's merely just my opinion. And it depends you know, on what you do in, in how much you're going to get out of Shiba Inu or an investment in general. So before we get started in this, Make sure you guys hit that like button. Also hit the subscribe button for more videos like this one. And make sure you check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel quite a bit. Also, if you guys want to uh, you know, check out my Twitter, at Perry8K over on Twitter. We post a lot about Shiba Inu, CRO, and apparently doors versus wheels, um, which was pretty interesting. And I don't know where you land. Let me know where you stand down below because it's always interesting to hear <laughs> why people think there are more doors then there are wheels on this earth. But anyways, uh, or the or vice versa, it's always interesting. But let's go ahead and talk about Shiba Inu because that's what you're here for. First, let's go through the price and what we're seeing Shiba Inu at right now before we get into uh, my spreadsheet because everybody knows that I have um, this spreadsheet to go over exit plans. But currently Shiba Inu, and I know this is very difficult to, to look at because it's a white screen. So just bear with me. I don't know why Coinbase keeps changing, but Currently, the price is at 0 .0000 .0000 2200 almost 2300 We can see that this has dropped from 2400 over the past day from March 9th um, all the way until March 10th, where it is today. Hit some lows here of actually being low 2200s, and now you're seeing it down at these lows again. Uh, we did see a decent size pop just recently. We saw this pop up here, uh, pushing us up to 23 and then decreasing us down to uh, uh, below 23, around 22 or high 22s. You can see in the last uh, last week, it's uh, down 8.7%. The last month, it's down 29.24%. And the last year, <clears throat> it's still up 114,000%, which is not as much as it was up, uh, you know, uh, a couple of weeks ago, you know, looking at it at 33 or 35 or even 40 or so. Um, if you look at the popularity, it's still 11th. You can see the trading activity is buy versus sell, 66% uh, buy versus uh, the 34% sell. Volume is down. It's at uh, $819 million worth of volume, which is still a lot of volume. Uh, but the market cap is at $12.4 billion. Uh, dollars and the typical hold time has decreased from what I saw. It's at 93 days of typical or 94 days of typical hold time. I believe we had 95 days, so it has been uh, making some moves. This might be where you know we hold for that many days. I mean, I feel like there's more people holding for a long period of time, so we might see that continue to go up and reach triple digits, which would be amazing. But um, not there yet. We're still in 94 days of typical hold time, so that's not bad at all. Now. People are asking me, again, like I said in the beginning, all the time, how can I make so much money with this? Because so many people made money from this point all the way up to this point. How can you make that much money? You know, how can you make even close to that much money? How can you be set for life? Because there are people out there that have billions, like 2 billion tokens, 3 billion tokens, and you know, hundreds of millions of tokens, but then there are people out there that only have uh, 10 million tokens or 20 million tokens or 1 million tokens, right? They can't really afford as much. So how can you find a way to make a lot of money or life-changing money out of Shiba Inu? Well, it's simple. If we go through my spreadsheet here, you're going to see here that I have Shiba Inu. We have uh, the starting count of coins. We have the actual APY that you would end up gaining if you staked your Shiba Inu for an APY. Let's say you staked your Shiba Inu for a 2% APY over on uh, coin or not Coinbase. I was going to say uh, crypto.com, right? And you're going to see an APY that you gain of uh, a total of 98,000 coins, which is not bad. For three three months, 98,000 coins, that could be life-changing money by itself. So while you're gaining that APY, it depends what you do in this situation and how much you're gonna be able to gain. Currently, you know what you invested in the beginning is $602 to have 20 million coins. Now, if you have 2 million coins, you're obviously getting less. Uh, if you have 
3 million coins or 1 million coins, you obviously have less that you, you have out there. So how can you be able to gain a lot out of this um, by just uh, going along the process like everybody else does? Well, all you have to do is sell at certain spots. All you have to do is is you can sell maybe somewhere around here. Uh, you could sell somewhere around here. You could sell somewhere around here. You could sell somewhere around here. But you have to figure out your exit plan in order to sell pieces. Don't sell all of it because what people will see is, oh, I turned $600 into $10,000. I need to get out of this, right? That's exactly what they think. And you can't tell me that I'm wrong. If you turn $600 into $10,000, you're going to take your gains or as much gains as you can get, right? And you're basically going to take it where you can take 70%, 80% of the position or 100% of the position. But what you need to understand is take some gains, but understand the future growth. So while we look at the uh, 20 million that's here, right? And we decide that we want to take uh, something, maybe $2,000 at this point, you want to take uh, 2 million coins or yeah, 2 million coins. You want to take 2 million coins. That's a thousand dollars. You're taking your initial investment plus more. Um, then when you get down to other, other rows that you have here, other, other time periods, other prices, you can take a little bit more. Cause right now you have left over 18 million coins, 18.8 million coins. So, you know, you can get to, uh, another level, maybe, um, 0 0.005, which is a half a cent. Right. And you can say, all right, I want to take a little bit more. That's worth $96,000. Yes, it's going to hurt to see you worth uh, $32,000 and maybe fluctuate $47,000, maybe fluctuate. But you have to figure out the best plan for you if you want to take 2 million coins, 5 million coins, 10 million coins, whatever it is. So then when you get to a point to where you're right here at maybe, um, you know, half a cent, you take 10 million coins. Right. And that's fifty thousand dollars that you end up profiting from. Now, what you have left over is you have nine million coins left. So you can let that sit there for one penny. You can let it sit there for twenty-five cents, for fifty cents, for a dollar. But you're going to be able to gain so much more as you make that decision the right way. So if you go down to two cents and you say, "I want to sell another um, maybe one million or two million coins. I want to sell two million coins." That's another $59,000 there. So total that you have there is $110,000 that you can put into other investments. Now that's not absolutely life-changing amounts of money. Now you can pay off cars and mortgages and, and stuff like that, especially since it's long-term. But if you look at the 7 million that you do have there, when you get down to a level, let's say of 25 cents, well, now you're at 1.9 million. That's life-changing amount of money in itself. So you can say, all right, I'm going to take 1.9 million and take all of it. You can literally take equal to whatever is right here and take all of it. And you have $2 million that you turn $600 into $2 million. Or you can take a portion of it if you believe that it's going to go further. And you can basically just say, I'm going to take another, uh, I'm going to take half of it. Maybe I'll take 3.5 million, right? That's $875,000. So total, you have about $1 million. Now you have 4 million that's left in there. You wait till it gets to a dollar and you say, you know what? I wanna take out everything there. And you basically turn uh, $600 into $5.3 million. So it's very easy to find a method um, that works best for you if you see the future growth in it. Now it's not guaranteed that anything here is going to happen like this because we don't know how much is gonna be burned off. We're trying to push to burn off as much as possible and impact the price in a big way. But we don't know where the popularity is. We don't know what the burns are gonna be. We don't know if they're gonna find a way to mint more coins. We really don't know uh, what will happen there. So this is all speculation, but $5.3 million is pretty big. So make sure you guys hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, make sure you check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. If you guys wanna follow me on Twitter, feel free to follow me on Twitter at Perry8K. And also give Sheba Burn uh, a follow. If you guys wanna check out that, it's at Sheba Burn ERC20, and they are burning off massive amounts of Shiba Inu, and I think they deserve a follow. But I'm gonna get out of here, and I will catch you guys in the next video.